Cops filmed live on location, Muncie, Indiana, with conjunction of hidden cameras and also amateur video. Parental discretion is advised due to some mild nudity and also injuring of animals. Remember, folks, make the kids step out of the room. Man, chill out. Hey, I just got the phone with Mr. Man, get out of the mirror, dude. Okay. okay. I just got off the phone with Mr. Parker, did you? Since we had to have the money tonight. Tonight? Tonight. Oh, God, we gotta get it, man. That dude, that dude is bad, chill it. What do you do? You do a change of that? Yeah. Right. I guess we'll just have to steal it or something. You better. Dude, her. Mark shot that chick. She probably got a big old delivery to make sure that she got paid off her own. Or she got paid off that other team, you know, so that's 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 I'm Matt Grystaff, we're here with Cops and Muncie, and we're responding to what a known crack house is here in one of the bad districts of Muncie. 1852, this is 321, we're responding to the crack house call on West Boulevard. Okay. Now the key is here, is we gotta go in quiet, we gotta go in fast. Ready, Tyler? filmed in memory of my partner, Tyler Bat, who died on location during the shoot. Tyler was taken to the hospital by helicopter, General Hospital, and was pronounced dead on arrival. <coughs> the muggy Marge Shock was also in critical condition for two weeks, but she is recovered. The muggers themselves were captured by the Navy SEALs in, in conjunction with the SWAT team and county sheriffs. Later on, it was discovered they were part of the neo-Nazi KKK Eskimo anti-terrorist group called the Schweinerfitzers, which is also headed by the evil descendants of Hitler himself. And the camera woman, who is also injured in this movie, only suffered minor injuries and a small concern. This is in memory of Officer Tyler Beck, 1960 to 1997. He was my partner and my best friend, also a master of disguise, SWAT team, and demolition. He died helping to save the city and make life better for people like you and me. He is the whole reason that cops are about, and he died what every cop lives for, to help serve his city. We'll miss you, Tyler. 
Thank you. And goodbye.